Yep, yes sir, yes sir. So um Ryan Garcia says Devin Haney's not a draw. And that's the reason that the the ticket sales are low. Well, I made a video before regarding Devin Haney, why are you even fighting Ryan Garcia? First and foremost, this fight ain't going to do well. I said that. And I stand by it. This fight is unnecessary, first of all. The only, you know, I don't know why Devin cho chose to fight Ryan Garcia. I don't understand. Man, not a champion. You trying to piggy bank off Tank. I mean, come on, bro. Look, I unfollow Tank because Tank just disgusting to me. Uh, with the stuff, well, he don't want to fight. You know, what I'm saying he don't want to take on the hard challenges. He, he just now fighting a black fighter and Frank Martin, but that's like a prime Floyd fighting uh, Andre Berto. So I, I don't have no respect for Tank at all. Um, he's a nobody to me at this point. I'll, I'll pay, I'll pay attention to the, to, to Tank when he start stepping up in competition. You know what I'm saying? Then I I I I I'll, I'll pay attention to Frank. Well, I'll pay attention to the Tank when he fights Devin Haney or Corey Stevenson or a big name. You know, a real big name like the top three in boxing. You know, when he keeps stepping up, but he taking Tank taking baby steps. All these little baby steps, bro, and you 30 some years old, cut it out, man. I ain't got time for Tank. Um, but um, Devin Haney, I respect Devin Haney's resume more than I do Tank's resume. But Devin Haney is has stepped back, has took a step back with this Ryan Garcia fight. I never liked this fight. It's a it's it's a it's a cherry pick. It's a real real cherry pick. Uh, you know everybody can see it. Um, Ryan Garcia has Ryan Tank exposed Ryan Garcia's value. Ryan Garcia has no value after he lost to Tank. The and and the way he lost to Tank, the man has no heart. Um. He fought stupid, fought like an idiot. He's been exposed. That little little fake value he had, okay, they did numbers. Him and Tank did numbers, you know. But since Ryan Garcia exposed, Ryan is not going to do no more numbers like that. You know, he's coming off a loss. That little fake win he won, that 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 ain't that ain't against a uh a unknown fighter don't mean anything, and now you put him in the lions den, lions den with uh, Devin Haney. Devin Haney wanted this fight like stupid, man. You know, stupid. You think I don't know what's wrong with Devin Haney's team? They think y'all gonna y'all think y'all gonna do some numbers? Y'all think y'all gonna do a million pay per views? Y'all y'all lying to yourself. This fight ain't gonna do half a million pay per views, man. Yeah, like y'all lying to yourself, bro. I just gotta keep it real. This fight ain't gonna do good numbers. It, it ain't selling. Ryan Garcia having a mental was having a mental breakdown throughout the whole fight. He's just now being quiet. When it's like two weeks left to fight for the fight to happen, he just now starting to slow down his his antics. But people didn't have faith. People thought Ryan was gonna quit. Uh, Ryan was gonna try to. Find a way to get out the fight. People, you know, was scared to buy a ticket. Was scared to put their money. Was scared to pay real big money. And knowing they probably weren't going to get their money back. So I don't blame people. It's Ryan Garcia's fault at, at a point. But also, even if Ryan Garcia was not crazy. And did everything right. The fight was not going to sell anyway. Regardless. You know it probably would have. It probably would have had better ticket sales in the arena. But as far as pay per view is concerned. I never had faith. 
that this was going to do numbers. It definitely ain't going to do close to a million. Or even half. I don't think it's going to do half a million. You know? And they're, they're going to blame. They're going to laugh. You know, the Mayweather scary team going to laugh at um, Devin Haney again regarding the numbers on, the, in the, on this fight. When the numbers come out. You know, scary tank. I don't have no respect for that side whatsoever. They're going to laugh. <sighs> like like this is a uh, junior high school or something. Like, so stupid. But, um, you know, and, and it's just going to be a mockery of boxing. But, yeah, I don't understand Devin. Why? I, I, I would rather have Devin fight Adrian Broner. I think him and Adrian Broner would have did better numbers than this. But, it, uh, Devin, I'm a fan of Devin, but he cherry picked on this one. Not a fan of this fight at all. Not a fan of his team. All these WWE tactics, you know. Bill Haney making stupid looking faces. You know, uh, they making a, they were clown, they, they was on some clownery ish, you know, this term, you know. This time around, they was on some clown. Get back to business, get rid of Ryan Garcia, and, and get some co- tough competition, man. Pitbull would have probably been better competition, you know. Pitbull, you know, if they want to fight Pitbull next, you know, that probably would have been better competition. You know, they already fought Regis. You know, I, I I don't know, man. Ryan Garcia just ain't it, dog. He just ain't it. I don't know what they see in Ryan Garcia. His what 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 the only thing they I think they can see is his damn Instagram followers. That's think they that they think that's gonna convert into cash money. It's not. It's not, bro. Them them, them folks ain't buying pay per view. You know. But uh, this is trash. The fight gonna be trash. It's gonna be an easy win for uh for um Devin Haney. It's a cherry pick fight. I would have rather Devin Haney fight um who 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 should Devin Haney have fought? Like I said, Adrian Broner. I I would rather him have fought Adrian Broner over um Ryan. Top boxes at one forty. Let's see who, who we got. You know, because there are some fights that uh, Devin could have picked that would have been better fights than this. Let's see who we got, though. Heavyweight, middleweight, 147. Teofimo trash. He got beat this last fight. Sabrio Matias. Don't nobody know him. Isaac Cruz. They done pumped up Isaac Cruz to number three. He trash too. But will probably be a better fight than Ryan Garcia. Devin Haney. So we ain't got Tank. Well, at least Devin wanted to fight Tank. Um, and Tank chickened out. But who we got? We got. Shakur Stevenson would have been a good fight, but Shakur was he was acting like a B. But anyway, he's at one thirty five, yeah. He was acting like a little B. So boxing just horrible, man. You got Tia Fimo. I don't know if this is ranked number one or what, but I'm just looking at one, two, three, four, the fourth top boxers. ESPN has him. So the 140 pounds trash. You got 147. Jared and his t- Terrence Crawford ain't doing crap. He he should have been fought another fight by now. It, boxing just is trash, man. Boxing is hot trash right now. It really is. So uh. I think the Devin Haney and a, a Broner fight would probably have been the best fight to make, to be honest with you. 
boxing is hot trash. Who we got? 140 pounds. Teofimo. Regis. Devin B. Him. Subrio Matias. Don't nobody know him. Jose Ramirez. Who is that? Josh Taylor. Who is that? Oh, he got beat already. He got beat by. Who did he get beat? Didn't he get beat by uh, Ryan? Jermaine Ortiz. Richard Hickinson. Boston is garbage, man. None of these names ring ring a bell. None of these that that just shows you what a sport is at. Devin Haney is not a soup well, I don't wanna shit on Devin Haney, but Wow. He he ain't Devin Haney just don't inspire the uh the masses. He don't. He don't inspire the masses. He he don't inspire boxing fans. He's not considered a superstar. This is the times we in where boxing is suffering. Tank, he could be a superstar. He could be bigger than what he is, but he don't want it. He want to cheat his way. Uh, he want to just take shortcuts and scam his way to uh, millions of dollars take the uh, least risk and make the biggest payday that's all Tank want to do he's trash he garbage so pretty much boxing is garbage at this point in time nobody I see that's all inspiring they got Teofimo Teofimo lost his last fight he trash Devin Haney may be the best well Devin Haney's probably the face of boxing I don't watch well for his weight division Devin Haney's the number one guy you know what I'm saying? Everybody else is garbage. Trash, including Tank. Trash. Even though Tank will probably dom was probably gonna dominate Frank Martin. Tank Tank has been overtraining though. Tank has been training since he got out of prison. Since he got out of jail. This boot this dude been training back and forth. He's it looks like he's staying in the gym a lot. He's probably overtraining. Dude, you don't fight till what July? You st- so it's it, he looked like he overtraining. He, he's in very good shape, Tank. He looks like he overtraining though. He's just training too damn much. You know what I mean? But uh, if I'm wrong, he gonna knock he gonna knock uh, Frank Martin out quick. You know. If I, if I'm wrong. If he's not overtraining, he he gon if he's just doing the right method of training training because he seems to be uh in that gym a lot, so I'm pretty sure he's getting sharper and sharper. And uh he gonna make quick work with Frank Martin if that's the case. But he looks like to it looked to me like he's just overtraining, bro. Like he, and, it, and 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 that's pretty much it, man. Peace.